So good morning, I'm uh, Monica Carmenta, the Executive Director of Communications for Albuquerque Public Schools. I'm Gilbert Gallegos, the Director of Communications. So we're outside Tony Huddle School about 7.45 this morning. A teacher reported seeing what looked like a student walk into the school with uh, what appeared to be a weapon. She immediately notified police. The school went into lockdown. At this point, what's most important to hear is that we don't have any confirmation of shots fired. So students inside Tony Hillerman are being um, escorted out of the classroom after police. In the classroom, we have a large presence of law enforcement and very much appreciate that this morning. They are going through the school classroom by classroom as those classrooms are Students are being walked over to Volcano Vista High School. Parents at Tony Hillerman have been notified and know to pick their students up. At this point, uh, the school is not totally evacuated yet, and classes at Tierra Antigua and Volcano Vista are continuing this morning as usual. Those schools are in a lockdown, but they are not canceled. It is Tony Hillerman right now where all the police activity is. Gil? So at this point, APD has jurisdiction over the law enforcement aspect of this. Uh, Bernalillo County Sheriff's Office, Rio Rancho Police, State Police are also assisting. And um, it's important to say that we did get on scene at the APD, NPCSO, and APS Police actually also. Um, we're able to get in the school quickly and isolate to where they think um, this was, report was seen at that point. Um, we have now slowed everything down and have tactical units inside the school just so we could be safe and secure and very methodical about how we clear the school to ensure that nobody's injured. But at this point, there's no injuries, there's no reports of shots fired, and everybody's safe at this point. So, as Monica said, I think we've cleared a lot of the school. We're not, we're still being methodical to make sure it's completely cleared and everybody's safe. So, when we know more, we'll, we'll give out more information. Also, just um, We'll give another update if we get one, but also follow our Twitter account. That's going to be our main source of uh, official information from APD. And we always post everything to APS.edu. APS.edu is your source for information always uh, first about our school. So we will be updating parents as the information becomes available. We would also like to tell parents and families with students here at Tony Hillerman that every possible precaution is being taken at this moment. It looks rather frightening in the background with such a large law enforcement presence, but this is our MO. We take these threats and reports extremely seriously, and um, police are always very, very helpful in making sure that we do everything we can to secure the safety of the students inside. Thank you. Thank you.